Ever found yourself intrigued by the scurrying, slender creatures known as weasels and ferrets? Well, you're certainly not alone. These fascinating animals are part of the Mustelidae family, a group that's teeming with mystery and intrigue. Weasels, with their agile bodies and voracious appetites, are key players in controlling rodent populations and have adapted to various environments. Ferrets, on the other hand, have a long-standing relationship with US humans, serving roles from hunting assistants to beloved pets. But there's more to these creatures than meets the eye. Their crucial roles in ecosystems, acting as both predators and prey, helps maintain the delicate balance of biodiversity. Studying them can aid in conservation efforts, ensuring these members of the Mustelidae family continue to thrive. So, let's uncover the mysteries that surround these nimble creatures, their lives, the challenges they face, and their significance in the natural world and beyond. Weasels, with their petite size and elongated bodies, are formidable predators. Let's take a closer look at these intriguing creatures. First, let's discuss the short-tailed weasel, also known as the stoat. This creature is a marvel of adaptability. With the ability to change its fur color from brown in summer to white in winter, the stoat is a master of camouflage, seamlessly blending into its environment whether it's the dense forests of North America or the chilly tundras of Eurasia. But it's not just about looking good. This color-changing trick is a vital survival tactic, helping the stoat to hunt and evade predators. And speaking of hunting, the stoat is known for its mesmerizing dance, a hypnotic display that stuns prey and allows the stoat to make its move. Next up is the long-tailed weasel, the largest of the weasel family in the Americas. This creature has a range that extends from Canada to Bolivia, making it one of the most widely distributed members of the Mustelidae family. Just like the stoat, the long-tailed weasel changes color according to the season. However, it maintains a distinctive black tip on its tail year-round. This species inhabits a variety of habitats and exhibits a similar diet to the stoat, but with a larger emphasis on larger rodents due to their size. Finally, we have the least weasel, the smallest member of the mustelid family. Despite its small size, it's a fierce predator with a diet consisting largely of mice and voles. This tiny creature can be found in a range of habitats, from grasslands to woodlands, and even in some urban areas. Each of these weasels, despite their differences, share a few common traits. They're all agile, adaptable, and incredibly intelligent, with unique hunting strategies that have been honed over millions of years of evolution. They're survivors, able to withstand the harshest of environments and thrive in a variety of ecosystems. These unique characteristics and behaviors highlight the weasel's intelligence and adaptability, ensuring their survival in diverse climates. Ferrets, primarily known in their domesticated form, share a history with humans dating back thousands of years. Let's dive deeper into the world of ferrets. These slender, agile creatures are cousins of the weasel and are known for their playful nature and curious personalities. They come in a variety of colors, from sable to albino, and each ferret has its unique markings, making them as individual as the people who keep them as pets. Ferrets have been domesticated for at least 2,000 years, with ancient cultures such as the Romans and Greeks utilizing them for rodent control. Over time, they've also been used for hunting rabbits, a practice known as ferreting. In fact, their Latin name, Mustela Putorius Furo, translates to stinky little thief, a nod to their hunting skills and their somewhat musky odor. These creatures are crepuscular, meaning they're most active during dawn and dusk. This trait, alongside their inquisitive and playful nature, makes them engaging pets for those willing to meet their needs. They require a lot of interaction and mental stimulation, often getting into small spaces and exploring their surroundings with relentless curiosity. In the wild, ferrets dwell in grasslands, making homes in burrows where they can hide from predators and hunt for prey. They're carnivores, with a diet primarily consisting of small mammals, birds and eggs. But domesticated ferrets have adapted to a diet of specially formulated ferret food, although they still retain their love for meaty treats. Historically, ferrets have played various roles in human societies. Beyond being used for hunting and rodent control, they've been symbols of status, featured in art, and even used in scientific research. 
Today they continue to captivate us as beloved pets, their antics bringing joy to households worldwide. Understanding ferrets, their characteristics, behaviors, and habitats helps us appreciate their significance in both natural ecosystems and human societies. They remind us of the intricate bond between humans and the animal kingdom, a relationship that spans centuries and continues to evolve. Though belonging to the same family, weasels and ferrets exhibit some fascinating differences. In terms of physical characteristics, weasels are often smaller, with elongated bodies that enable them to chase prey into burrows. Their fur changes color with the seasons, providing them with excellent camouflage. Ferrets, on the other hand, are larger and have a more uniform coloration throughout the year. They also feature a distinct musky odor, a result of scent glands used for marking territory. When it comes to behaviors, weasels are solitary creatures, each one carving out a territory and fiercely defending it. They're voracious and skilled hunters, using their agility and cunning to catch a variety of prey. Ferrets, especially in their domesticated form, are more sociable and playful. They do have a predatory instinct, but it's often overshadowed by their curious and engaging nature. And then, there's the matter of habitat. Weasels are adaptable, found in a wide range of environments from forests to grasslands and even urban areas. They're native to various parts of the world, including North America, Europe and Asia. Ferrets, however, are domesticated creatures, bred by humans for centuries. While they're adaptable to a variety of living conditions, they're most commonly found in human homes, as pets or working animals. Despite their differences, both weasels and ferrets play crucial roles in maintaining the delicate balance of biodiversity. Our exploration of weasels and ferrets reveals the intricate balance of the natural world. These nimble mustelids, each with their unique traits and behaviors, play vital roles in maintaining biodiversity. Their survival stories remind us of nature's resilience, while their relationship with humans underscores our interconnectedness. The more we understand these fascinating creatures, the better we can conserve them. As we continue to learn about these fascinating creatures, we can ensure their survival and appreciate their role in our world even more.